हेलो स्टूडेंट्स होप यू आर डूइंग वेल एम एच टी सेट इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट पॉपुलर स्टेट लेवल बी टेक एंट्रेंस एग्जाम विद ऑलमोस्ट फोर लाख प्लस टेकर्स एवरी ईयर एज द एंट्रेंस एग्जाम इज कम्प्लीटली बेस्ड ऑन महाराष्ट्र क्लास इलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ सिलेबाई इट इज नॉट अ चैलेंजिंग टास्क टू स्कोर वन फिफ्टी और अबव ईच स्टूडेंट अपियरिंग फॉर द एग्जाम विल हैव अ नॉलेज ऑफ इलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ सिलेबस एंड द टारगेट कैन बी अचीव विद अ प्रॉपर स्टडी प्लान Among the class 11th and 12th syllabi 80% of the questions will be from 12th syllabus and only 20% of the questions will be from the 11th syllabus therefore it makes it easy for a student to revise the syllabus effectively and score 150 plus in the entrance exam in this video we have made an analysis of the most important tips and tricks that will help you in scoring 150 or above in the mht set exam Before moving forward let us have an overview of the MHT set exam pattern the MHT set exam will be conducted for two different streams that is PCM and PCB the candidate who will choose PCM stream will appear for physics mathematics and chemistry for the exam the mathematics section will have the maximum weightage which will be conducted for a total of 100 marks it will consist of 50 questions and for each question two marks will be awarded similarly the chemistry and physics both collectively will comprise of 100 questions and 100 marks similarly the candidate who will choose the pcb stream will appear for physics chemistry and botany and zoology in case of mathematics for pcm each subject for pcb will consist of 50 questions which will be for one marks each and the total marks of the paper will be 200 now let us look at some of the most important topics that you will have to focus on in order to score 70 plus marks in mht set for trigonometry chapter the expected questions is 6 and so you can expect a marks of 12 from trigonometry alone that is you will get a questions of 12 marks alone from trigonometry chapter From straight line chapter, you can expect questions four to five, and similarly marks eight to ten. For integration, you can expect four questions of a total of eight marks. For probability, you can expect four to five questions for eight to ten marks. For vector plus three D, you can expect five questions of ten marks. For matrices and determinants, you can expect three questions of six marks. For matrices logic statement, you can expect two to three questions for four to six marks. For differentiation, you can expect three questions of six marks, and for differential equations, you can expect two to three questions of four to six marks. Hence, it is clear that the above topics contribute to seventy marks in the mathematics sections of MHT set. Therefore it is important to give top priority to these chapters while preparing for the exam once you are proficient with these chapters you can proceed with other chapters to score more than 70 marks now let us look at how to score 40 plus marks in mht set for chemistry the chemistry section of mht set will comprise of 50 questions for 50 marks also it is easy to get 40 plus marks in chemistry subject by revising the most important topics as we will discuss now for basic concepts you can expect 2 to 3 questions for 2 to 3 marks for thermodynamics you can expect 3 questions for 3 marks for redox and electrochemistry you can expect 5 questions of 5 marks for pdf block elements you can expect 6 questions for 6 marks For alcohol phenol ether you can expect 5 questions for 5 marks for alkene and arene you can expect 2 questions for 2 marks for polymers you can expect 2 questions for 2 marks for coordinate compound you can expect 3 questions for 3 marks and for chemical bonding you can expect 2 questions for 2 marks hence it is clear that the above topics will carry a total of 30 marks in mht set Therefore it is advisable to be proficient with these chapter first and then revise the rest of the chapters in the chemistry to score 40 plus marks Now how to score 40 plus in MHT set for physics subject Like chemistry the physics section carries a total of 50 marks for a total of 50 questions 
with a proper revision it is easy to score 40 plus marks in physics now let us look at most of the important topics in physics subjects for mhd set for measurement chapter you can expect five questions for five marks for wpe you can expect three questions for three marks for gravitation you can expect three questions for three marks for bulk matter you can expect four questions for four marks for SHM and waves, you can expect 5 to 6 questions for 5 to 6 marks. For current, you can expect 3 questions for 3 marks. For EMI, you can expect 3 questions for 3 marks. For optics, you can expect 5 questions for 5 marks. For dual nature, you can expect 4 questions for 4 marks. And for electronic devices, you can expect 3 questions for 3 marks. From these data, we can say that the above topics will carry almost 40 marks in the physics section of MHD set. Therefore, it is important to emphasize on these chapters first and then proceed with the rest of the chapters to improve your score. Now that we are done with physics, chemistry and mathematics section, now let us look at how you can score 150 plus marks collectively in MHD set exam. As per the subject wide strategy that will help you in scoring 150 in MHD set, you are also advised to refer to the list of most important topics for physics, chemistry and mathematics along with the expected number of questions. Let us look at the preparation strategy which you can follow to score 150 plus marks in MHD set. To the total number of most important chapters to be revised in mathematics is 9 which will consist of a total of 70 marks. The total number of most important chapters to be revised in chemistry is 9 that will consist of a total of 30 marks. The total number of most important chapters in physics consists of 10 topics which will consist of a total of 40 marks. Hence, for a total of 28 most important chapters in physics, chemistry and mathematics, you will be able to score 140 marks in total. Hence, it is clear that 140 marks can be achieved by revising the most important topics mentioned in this video. To score more than 150, you will need to focus on other topics that are mentioned in the syllabus of MHD set and you can also practice the maximum number of mock tests. We hope that the above strategy to score 150 plus in MHD set was helpful to you. If you still have any query, you can also ask us the same through the provided link. Also, if you are looking for direct admission to BTEC and other courses, you can also fill the common application form on the provided link. For more updates on MHD set exams, stay tuned to College Deco. If you like this video, do like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.